Hey, so you know the M16, yeah, the gun that Rockstar Games used to sort of market GTA 5 way back in 2013? Yeah, well, that's that's in the game now, in 2022, finally. I swear, GTA Online had to be one of the only games that were set in the modern day that didn't have an M16, but those days are over, it's here now, and it's actually kind of a little bit hard to get. So this is gonna be a really quick video showing you how to unlock it. If you enjoy this video, a thumbs up would be awesome. Subscribe for more stuff like this and let's go. Okay, so to unlock the M16, you actually have to collect five weapon parts for it. For those weapon parts, they're gonna spawn randomly around the map at one of these 10 locations that you can find on the screen now or on GTA web, which in my opinion is the best map you can find online for finding things like treasure hunts and almost anything you need to know about the GTA 5 map locations. So all you need to do is fly or drive around the map go to these specific locations and see if a crime scene has spawned now a lot of people in the community are saying that you need to be in a lobby for 20 minutes or a lobby has to have been active for 20 minutes in order for these crime scenes to spawn now this is kind of up in the air i don't have any concrete facts pointing to whether this is true but all i can say is i was in a lobby by myself for over an hour and i couldn't find one and then i jumped into an online public session with other players helping me out and I found one in about five or 10 minutes. So my recommendation for you is try to do this with friends if you can, or if you see other people driving around the map looking for it, send them a text and see if you can help each other out. Personally, for me, I wanna give a quick shout out to Dayton and Bionicle in this lobby. These were the guys that helped me out, so shout out to you, thank you. So as you can see, I walked into the crime scene, picked up the M16 part off the floor. That was my first one out of the five that I need to collect, and that one gave me $5,000. Now, each of these weapon parts are gonna give you $5,000 when you pick them up, and then once you get all of them, you're gonna get the M16 and an extra $50,000. So you're gonna get $75,000 total along with the gun. And that's pretty much it. So I'll leave a link to the map in the description below. I'll put it on screen again now so you can sort of see the locations. Good luck on your adventure. Treasure hunting, hope you're staying safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Poise. But you won't find me on